How's it going everybody? Rob here with Gone Fishing Colorado and today I am going to finally replace my uh, net, my basket. So you can see it's falling apart, breaks and rips, fishing line and twangles here that's holding it together. And Fish Pond makes nice replaceable baskets for these. Remember to get the correct size you guys. There is four different sizes. This is the guide net um, Nomad hand net. Okay. And uh, let's get started on this. So it comes with the basket itself, which I don't know if there's a front or back to that, as well as a long piece of rope and that needle attached to it. So let's see here. I should say string, not rope. So let's see here. Let's get this down here first, you guys. Let's figure out where the way this basket's supposed to sit. Or maybe it's not. I think it's a complete circle. So, let's get this trash out of the way. And they started it right here. So, once we got all the string out, run our hands around there, make sure. Let's see. I've never done this before, so this is my first go at it as well. And it can't be that bad, so let's see here. Let's get the basket and let's choose a starting point. We're going to choose right here. Actually, I need to come from the outside in. So, guys, first come from the outside in I would say like so okay grab a loop like this that knot is there a knot at the end of this line all right so there's no knot here you guys what I'm gonna say is we just make a little knot right here okay a little knot should caught should get it stuck right there oops hold on Line, spin it around itself. Come on, there we go. And if it doesn't, I'll tell you what, I'll just run it right back through it and interlock it. That's exactly what I'm going to do. And then through that loop, you guys, I'm just going to do this. Boom. Boom. So if it is going to slip at any point, it'll restick. And I think this is how they had it set up. And I'll clean that up later. All right. Let's see here. So now we just got to follow. Go through the next hole. Tighten that up. Like so. Grab the end of this again. Gonna go through this one, back out that same hole. There we go. And really, guys, I think we just have to work this all. And last but not least, you guys, we are in the last hole now. I'm going to come back out this. And now the real question is what kind of knot to tie right here. You know what I'm going to do, you guys? So, you end right here, right? Let's see if I can get the camera angled down. So here's the real question. I'm going to tell everybody probably fast forward until this part. What's the best way to knot? Well, you have a hole right here, you guys, right? So here's my last hole. Here's my next hole. I'm going to bring this line under this, 
like so. And I'm going to knot off right there. Because that's going to cinch down on itself. Now I can go back around. I can make a normal fishing knot. I mean a normal knot. Not even a fishing knot. Just a good old regular knot. And we're going to tighten that down. Like so. Let's not do that. I'm going to come back in here, you guys, and do one more knot. Really tightening off everything. Why not one last one for safekeeping? There we go. We are tightened off right there. And I'm going to snip this, you guys, like so. I'm going to leave some extra line on here. No reason not to. Left a nice little tag. I'm going to come back to where I started. You know what? That's going to hold right there. Alrighty you guys, brand new basket on the fish pond. Hope you like this video, hope this helps somebody. Real easy to replace. Um, as you can see, I tore mine up. Look at the color difference. And uh, yeah, this is Roth with Gone Fishing Colorado. Subscribe right here, and here's some more videos. We're gonna keep producing videos to help all the fishermen out out there. And that'll do it for today. Thanks for watching.